Meningotomy is the insertion of tympanic membrane with the purpose of drainage of separative or non-separative effusion of the middle ear. The second purpose is also to provide aeration in case of eustachian tube malfunction and grommet may also be used to provide aeration. Indications for myringotomy first acute separative otitis media in that when there is severe earache and bursting of tympanic membrane or in incomplete resolution with opaque eardrum and persistent conductive hearing loss or in complications of acute otitis media for example facial nerve paralysis, meningitis or labyrinthitis with bulging tympanic membrane or in recurrent acute otitis media. Second otitis media with effusion. Third aerotitis media to drain the fluid and unblock the eustachian tube. Fourth atelectic ear for long term aeration, grommet is inserted. Fifth intratympanic injections. When several intratympanic steroid injections are to be used in sudden sensory neural hearing loss. We are seeing the types of the myringotomy. Two types of incision is made on the tympanic membrane. In patient with acute superiority otitis media, a circumferential incision is made in the posterior inferior quadrant of the tympanic membrane midway between the handle of malleus and tympanic annulus holding injury to the incudostapedial joint. In patient with serous otitis media or otitis media with effusion, a small radial incision is made in the anterior inferior quadrant of tympanic membrane and all effusion is set out. Here is the picture. Complications of the myringotomy are injury to incudus tapedial joint, injury to jugular bulb with profuse bleeding, middle ear infection and permanent perforation.